Hi guys! So today is a very auspicious day. It's about nine in the morning. I really need to go. And um, today is the day of my final exam. I can't stay too long to tell you what I'm gonna get up to for the rest of the day because I'm gonna be super busy and I have to leave right now to go to my exam. It's uh, my second Asian and African exam. And I'm gonna be asked questions on Japan if you're interested, but anyway, I really have to go. But hello, welcome to the vlog. And um, summer, my summer begins today and I'm so excited. I'm free! Oh my God, guys, I'm so excited. The exam went fine, um, it was an exam and the questions were doable and I wrote two complete essays so I'm just pleased with that to be honest now I can just get on with my summer but yeah I'll update you guys some more when I'm home but I also look like an absolute, I call this the revision hag look, it's not good. Here's my post exam breakfast. Um, I've only got one piece of bacon, which is sad. Oh so guys, here's the plan for the rest of the day. I literally have to move out completely by four o'clock because um, I have to make it back to Zach's um, house for dinner tonight, um, with Zach, obviously, um, because he, otherwise he's not gonna see his parents for like six weeks, because obviously Mexico's in a week's time, oh my God. Um, and yeah, and I can't go tomorrow because I really need to be in London for the full week this week Because um, I've got a lot to do so hopefully you guys can follow me on like my preparation for Mexico But that means that I have to move out completely today and the plan was to do it bit by bit um, Over the last week revision just completely got in the way There's just no way I could have dedicated like hours of my time to cleaning the room out so most of the stuff is going to Zach's. I took most of my clothes down last time I went down. And most of what's left is going to Zach's apart from whatever clothes are left up here that I want for the summer and um, my makeup and all that kind of stuff because he has a 12 month lease so when I get back in September, I'll be able to just move my stuff out of his into my new flat. Um, so sad to be leaving this flat, it's such a nice flat. Yeah, gotta move everything today over to his, we've got a 10 month lease which ends in the beginning of June, but obviously I will be gone. And I need to get it all out this week. Um, the first thing we're gonna do is the kitchen um, and extract all my stuff because I think that's gonna be the most boring bit. Um, and then I can just start loading stuff in the car. Zach lives just down the road, but um, obviously I'm gonna have to put it all in the car and then unpack it all at his. My bean bags are gone, guys. Um, so we've made some progress with the room. It's looking, um, well, you wouldn't really know it because it's actually still full of crap, but it's looking a little bit more empty. And now I'm gonna put some makeup on my face so you don't have to look at Revision Hag anymore. And, um, pack it. Hurrah! Ta-da! I have transformed. Also, look what I found and look what I'm wearing. I found it in my, um, one of my drawers, clearly from when it was unacceptable, I don't know why I'm so close, um, when it was unacceptable to wear ankle anklets in Edinburgh from sometime last year and also because obviously it's really hard to wear them with boots. But anyway, so I've put it on because summer has begun. So two trips are done to Zach's and back. One more trip, I think, to Zach's, and then we can just start packing the car to go home. I still have a few last minute bits to go in, like makeup, toiletries, um, sunglasses, very important. Um, what else is to go in? To be packed, I don't know, but almost there. So that's it, guys. The room is empty. No, I didn't use the weird curtain things on my wardrobes. Why is it not focusing? It looks very sad. 
very, very sad. I left the sexy man smell that you may or may not remember from Vlogtober. But everything is empty. I love this room. It's so nice. feeling very emotional but I think that's probably the whole no sleep thing I don't know but emotion we're off <laughs> bye Edinburgh so sad it's quite a nice day as well right we're going hi guys um sorry for not vlogging the rest of yesterday but by the time we got back it was late and then we were just chatting to sex family and then we went to bed and I feel like a new woman now I've had some sleep and um, I've reorganized some things so that we're gonna stay here tonight as well otherwise Zach won't see his parents for six weeks um, because yeah we arrived much later than we planned yesterday because packing took forever um, but I'm glad it's all done. Now we're gonna get dressed, we've had some breakfast, watched the latest Game of Thrones, which we haven't had um, the chance to watch yet. I was telling Zach that I'm really sad because um, the series is like progressing beyond the book storylines or changing things. And either I'll now know what's gonna happen in the books because like George R. R. Martin does have some say in the series, Either I'm going to know what's happening in the books before it happens or I'm going to be following sets of characters on like two separate storylines which is really annoying and I'm not happy and I look like a ghost in this light. Now um, and neither of us, well usually what we do when we travel is we just wear the same clothes for two days which is gross but then we don't have to get stuff out of the car because the car is packed full of stuff but now we're staying for a second night and we're going out to dinner tonight. We're gonna go shopping, got some things to buy anyway for Mexico, um, which we may as well do today. Zach's hay fever slash cat fever has begun. I had some nice snuggles with the cat this morning that I should have vlog vlogged, but I didn't. We're gonna go to Trafford Centre. That's what I've been trying to say for the last like three minutes. Get some <laughs> clean clothes. It's just an excuse to buy clothes. Guys, it looks like our stuff is still in the car. Woohoo! never been to Manchester before which is really sad um, but I will now have been to the trip and that's how exciting um, it's huge that's all I have to say so far about my impressions and yeah it's shop so I got some comical knickers in uh, Topshop because I needed them that's, that is like the business. and um, Zach got us some nice men's t-shirts because they're actually really neat. Oh yeah. Um, we do like a bit of shampoo that Lush has. I don't, it was supposed to be in the favourites and then I used a different version of the favourites that I filmed. Which it wasn't in. Um, but Lush sea salt, sea salt shampoo is great. Um, for giving you a... It is for me. I like it. Yeah. If you like kind of like a literally just got out of the sea kind of look. I mean it's not as good as the sea but it's the closest like I've ever been. Trout. I look like I'm trying to see. Mmm, smells good. This guys. It's great. So I'm about to try this on in Zara. Cloud top is gonna look really nice and really horrible. Definite, definite no. So <laughs> Zach's running away from me. 
because is it because I'm filming myself? I don't know. Um, we have finished up. I ended up going back into Topshop because um, I couldn't find anything that I liked, and I just really didn't want to wear the top I've been wearing for like two days tonight to dinner. So yes, couldn't find anything anywhere else. So I went back into Topshop and bought a couple nice little bits. I'll show you guys in a minute. And it's really annoying when it does not focus on me. Um, we're gonna go home now and um, get some dins. Where are we going for dinner tonight? Oh yeah, we don't know. I don't know why I did that. I was gonna show you my new shirt, that's what I was thinking in my head about. I'm not thinking straight, but we've just got back. We've just got back. We got back a while ago from dinner. We went to, what's it called, Temujin. It was really be nice. Um, and yeah, this is one of my new shirts anyway, that's what I was gonna show you. Let me take this off. It's just um, pretty basic really, but it's nice. Looks nicer in person. And what else? Yeah, I'll show you my knickers because they're the most amusing bit. I'm already wearing some, they've got kiwis on. These say sweet cheeks. These have hot dogs. These have bananas. And is that it? And I also got, well, I'll show um, the other top, top, top in a haul or something and the t-shirts that we bought. I also got myself in this little cute baby Selfridges bag. Um, I got myself a new Illamasqua Precision Ink because it's my favorite eyeliner and it's in Abyss, which is the black color, but yeah. And it's usually sold out online, so I thought whilst we were there, would pick it up. Um, but yeah, so tomorrow we're off to home, to yeah. London home. So we're off again. It's a really beautiful day outside, actually. Um, I apparently is it cloud? It's supposed to be cloudy in London, though, isn't it? Cloudy but warm. But anyway, we're gonna go to London. Yeah, we're gonna go probably go to Westfields. Um, maybe get some Mexican dinner to get in the mood at Oaxaca. And um, yeah, start doing some bits of Bob's and I'll show you guys what we're gonna get up to. But I'm really sad because um, I don't have any contact lenses left. I'm gonna need sunnies today driving. And I'm just gonna have to live with it. So we just stopped for um, some food. We didn't have breakfast this morning and we also missed petrol. And we've held back on the unhealthy service station food. Being good. Hello. Got waitrose. This is really hard to do with one hand. Waitrose crayfish porn and rocket sandwiches. I got a skinny sugar free, well it ended up being a hazelnut macchiato. Not everyone has all the sugar free um, sit ups. And then, <sighs> we're going to continue on our journey. What else did we get? Is that it? Oh yeah, and I got, we got some mango as well. Unlocking it. Hello. Hello, Mies. Hello, where's my 11 year old sister? Mies. <laughs> because a little bit, because she had to have a blood test today. Oh, why? And vaccinations. So we just carried all the stuff from the car up the like five flights of stairs and we can safely say that that is our workout done for the day. I feel exhausted. So we're gonna go get some dinner now. Well, not now, we're gonna shower first. Get ready and then go and get some dinner um, and then come back here and tonight I think I'm gonna catch up on some editing and, cause I've got lots of stuff that I need to edit that's been sitting on the computer for ages. 
and also probably unpack as well so that's all ready tomorrow to start a big load of washing and all that kind of boring stuff also this is one of my new t-shirts that we got yesterday um it's the oversized style and then zach also gets the oversized long line style both of which are nice shapes obviously this is kind of like a dress on me it's that long and that's just the oversized one but i just think they they fit really nicely oh i'm still tired it's been like 10 minutes and i'm still feeling it do you feel fresh This camera is really distracting because I always have to check we're in focus and then you end up looking at yourself. But yeah, anyway. We are off finally for dinner. to do any work right now. It's like 10 o'clock or something. So, I'll see you guys tomorrow, maybe, or in the next vlog, maybe. I don't know how long it is. Probably in the day, actually. I need to start again tomorrow, so. Hope you enjoyed this vlog, guys. Um, let us know what's left to come.